Hey, this is Josiah Bawalda with Hybrid Audio Technologies again, and today we're going to do a quick little setup video on the director and saving presets. Now, in the previous video, we set our inputs, our outputs, and our crossovers. Today, we, uh, as you can see, we've already got all that set up, and I've got uh, up here, you can see up in the test box that we saved under test one for our preset number one. Uh, we're using the P6 today uh, with paired with the director. Now, just remember that now that we're, since we are using the director, that we are using the 90 degree USB that came with the director and we are plugged into the back of the director uh, and no longer plugged into the DSP itself. The 8 pin communication cable will be plugged into the DSP and that'll be how we go about tuning and everything um, only using the director. Now how do we activate the director? That's, that's a question. Um, right off the bat it'll automatically start in demo mode whenever you connect to the to the DSP. The director today is running the 1.5 software and the DSP P6 is using the 3.4A software. We haven't yet updated to the 4.06, but we will. Um, so if we wanna go and, uh, we've already set our, our inputs and outputs here, as you can see, next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go to our DCM and you can see that device configuration menu, the remote control here, it's on off. The only thing we're needing to do to enable that director to get it off of demo mode is go ahead and click the X here and now that now that is activated go back to our main page you can still see that nothing here has changed but we need to make sure that we save and store always make sure that we save and store or else the director will continue to start in demo mode trying to connect to the p6 so we're going to go up here we're going to go to save and store we're going to go ahead and click under our number one and as you can see here we are loading our software into the DSP and it's saving our presets. And you see it downloading here. And now we've saved into preset number one. Now, preset number one, preset number two, are going to be the only thing available when we're only using a DSP but since we've got the director we've got 20 additional presets and as you can see here if I were to you know mess with something and want to save another preset I go to save and store as you can see I've already saved five presets here uh, and all you got to do is just you want to click on it go ahead and click save and it'll it'll run you through it but for, for the purpose of the video we're going to go ahead and we're going to click on our six preset here we're going to click save into our six preset I'm going to name it test six save it it's going to load into the DSP itself. And now if I were to click here on the names, I've got six name presets in here and I can go all the way down to 22. So I only use three presets. I use my SQ, my street tune, and my bass tune. but. This has 20 extra presets that you can use via the director, so you can use as many as you want. Now the director will not allow you to switch between these presets while it is connected to a uh, computer. You cannot, it will not let you, it'll, it'll get rid of some of the features. It'll still let you turn the volume up and down and the subwoofer up and down. But while it's connected to a laptop or a computer, the director is, is just there for communication between the DSP uh, PC tool and the, the P6. As soon as you save and store and you disconnect the USB from it, the full control of the director will be back. Um, you can click the knob, roll it back and forth. What you're wanting to do is want to access these presets when you're actually looking at the director. Is if you go to sound setups and you roll the knob back and forth, left and right, you'll actually see that it changes numbers. Now in order to make that preset stick, you actually need to click that button and it'll save and store that preset and now it'll give wait about 10 seconds and it'll be loaded onto the software and it'll switch presets for you. Like always, you can always call us here at 770-888-8200 or always email me, Josiah, at jbewalda at hybrid-audio.com. I hope you learned something today and watch out for more videos. Thank you.